Not only is there a nuclear connection from UAP activity, yeah. there's a nuclear connection in terms of U.S. government equities and how they've protected the program through nuclear provisions. Yeah. Grush shows that the language of the 1954 Atomic Energy Act, which defines which materials are subject to nuclear secrecy, was written in a sneaky but deliberate way to protect our UFO secrets, too. If you actually read the Atomic Energy Act, if something is not a nuke, but it has radiological energy coming off it, you know, alpha, beta decay, whatever. Same secrecy. Same secrecy. Legendary UFO researcher Jacques Vallée also says that the Department of Energy and the Manhattan Project clearance system is the most applicable to UFOs. The Manhattan Project would have custody of it, and then it would go into the Department of Energy, which has its own line of clearances. And that's why I can't find among the people mm. I know who have clearances above top secret, they've never heard of this.